In this video, we learn to estimate the mean of a group frequency distribution from discrete data. So what is discrete data? Discrete data is data which has specific values. Like um, an example would be size of clothes. You could only have sizes such as 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18 and so on. So you can't have a size 11.2 for example, but you could have height being 183.5 centimetres. So height in this case is the continuous data and the size of clothes is discrete data, so specific values when it comes to discrete data. The example that I have here is um, the marks that have been received by a group of students. So we've got seven, six, 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 four, two, three, five, six, eight, seven, five, three, zero, five, six, nine. So this table tells you that you failed the exam if you scored between zero and four. You pass if you score between five and six or five and six. You get merit if you score 7 or 8 and distinction if you score 9 or 10 marks. Now we'll see what this means. Frequency is how many of these marks you'd see in the class. So looking at fail between 0 and 4, we've got a 4 here. So there is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So there would be five fails and between five and six, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Merit, we've got one, two, three. And distinction, we've got only one. So normally when you work out the mean, you'd have specific values. So in this case, between 0 and 4, it's a range of values. We have 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4. But we're going to find the mid value. So as I said, it's 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4, all included. So in the middle is the 2. So we're going to find that mid value or midpoint and between five and six we've got only five and six so it's going to be 5.5 between seven and eight is 7.5 between nine and ten is 9.5 so if you're not given the number of marks but you just have this table and you'd be told that five learners received a fail, you don't know then whether they got a zero, one, two, three or four marks. So that's why we find a midpoint and we multiply it by that mid value or that midpoint, which in this case is a two. So two lots of five is 10, eight lots of 5.5 is 44, Three lots of 7.5 is 22.5 and one lot of 9.5 is just 9.5. So we'll add all of these together. So we have 10, one carried over, one and four is five and nine is 14 and two is 16, 1 and 1 is 2, and 4 is 6, and 2 is 8. So it's 86 the total. But we still need to divide this by how many values we have. So we have 86 divided by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17.
and this gives us 5.059 and this is an estimate of the mean of the grouped frequency distribution from discrete data in this example.